okay guys just gonna make a quick little video i'm just gonna show you guys how i make my guinness punch designs in the background making a little music so i've got my vanilla i'm gonna use about one teaspoon of vanilla i've got my guinness i got my nutriment and i got my coconut condensed milk as well as a nutmeg i've got grated nutmeg but fresh nutmeg is always better and always remember guys never mix your guinness punch in with a metal spoon with anything metal or in a metal bowl always use a plastic glass or wooden utensils always use that so first i'm going to empty my guinness Oof, empty my guinness and obviously guys i won't be drinking this all in one day because i do breastfeed although they say um not a lot of the alcohol goes into the breast milk so i'm just gonna empty my guinness that's a lot of guinness yeah this bowl might be a bit too small but i think I think these ones have a lot more than the glass jar there's something inside of it oh guys that's weird there's a ball that comes in it you won't be able to see it there's a ball that comes in it. I guess it kind of keep, it keeps it fresh or something like that yeah and you can't see it I'll cut it and then show you guys so I've got that Guinness there I'm gonna open my nutriment and I'm gonna pour that in. By the time I finish, this bowl will be filling over. Yeah, put my nutriment in. Then I'm gonna put about one tablespoon of condensed milk, coconut condensed milk. With the coconut condensed milk, it takes out. It's a lot harder to mix out, and this would be better if you mix it in a bottle or a jug. I don't have any jugs at the moment, so I'm just using this. It's just a quick little one, two, three. You know, you can make this in literally three minutes. I'm at what? 2 minutes 50, so say about 4 minutes. Then, it's going to, you can also blend some oats and put in, but I'm not going to blend any oats because that's just a bit long. So, let me take that out because that's going to just mess with the taste. So, I need just a teaspoon. And that's it. That's if the metal has messed with the taste already. And mm, sweet. Then we're gonna add our nutmeg. We need probably a couple of grates, not that much. Use about a quarter of that, and then we just mix. As much as I like experimenting, I like to keep my Guinness punch as simple as possible. However, guess what? I'm gonna put in just thought about it. I'm gonna put my sea moss, of course, guys. To put about a heaping tablespoon of sea moss. Mm, you can see that gel? Check out my previous two videos if you want to see how I made my sea moss gel. Thank you. Anyways, back to the video. So, all right. So I put the sea moss gel in there. Bearing in mind, the sea moss gel would most likely not mix out properly. So we're just gonna, I don't mind the lumps of sea moss gel in there, 
because it will dissolve over time. Yeah, you want some? You can't have any of this. So that's it, guys. Dragon Scout. Mm hmm. Gonna share myself a little glass. A little glass, guys. A little, yeah? Because. And. I think that's enough for one day. So, just my dragon start. With Seamus. Okay, guys, so. As per usual, I got my usual eating afterwards. I got some sweet potato fries. Mm. Um, I've got the Guinness punch or whatever. I, I, I watered it down with some oat milk. Because I don't want to have too much alcohol in my system. So, half of this is oat milk. And I've got jerk chicken that I got from my mom yesterday. So, These sweet potato fries are left over from when I ordered some food the other day because they sent me an extra one so and I couldn't finish it so I left it in the fridge and perfect time to have it with some jerk chicken mm. <laughs> yeah mm. okay so now well, let me try this and see how it tastes. Mmm. It's really nice, even though it's been even though it's been watered down with the oat milk, it actually tastes really good. That is nice. I would love to give you some, but these people are going to call police on me if I give you any. Mm -hmm. So, I'm going to taste the chicken. Look at that. So, you guys. By the time I posted this um, video, you might have already seen um <clears throat> my vlog of me going to my mom so <clears throat> check out my previous video if not check out the video after this one you see the vlog of of um my mom tracking up some chicken me and my sister cooking some pastry my brother and this little one spending a lot of time with her auntie Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, and when I say this chicken tastes good, this chicken tastes good. I never go to Jamaican shops and buy jerk chicken because they just never um, taste authentic. But this, mm, this one's jerked, proper jerk seasoning, mm, marinated. Mm. Mm. We also had different things if you guys want to see um, what I spent my day doing. Quarantine, when you have a nice backyard and a dirt pan, you guys check that video out. Mm. I said, This chicken is good. This chicken is type of chicken that you put on a piece of white bread. I don't need nothing else other than ketchup. Mm.
<laughs> it's nice. Mm, so good. Mm. You want some too? Oh man, I can't wait till she start to eat. Girl, men are gonna be chowing down. I'm sorry, Baba. Is it not spicy? Hmm? <laughs> it's spicy, you know, and she's not even like. Fine. You like stop fooling me. I want the real thing. Mm. <laughs> Anyways, guys, this video shouldn't be 10 minutes long, so I'm gonna leave you guys. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna give you a last look at that chicken. Remember guys, like, share, comment, and subscribe and you'll get peace. Bye.